Welcome back, everyone. The Pecan Street Festival continuing today, and uh, you can catch this big guy right here rolling into town. It is the Johnsonville Big Taste Grill, the world's largest touring grill. It's 65 feet long and weighs 53,000 pounds. Plenty of space to whip up 2,500 brats for an hour. It is all for, uh, or 2,500 brats per hour, maybe. All for a good cause. And this morning, grill master Steve Hensley joins us. We couldn't pass up an opportunity to get these brats in studio. I think this is going to be our lunch and breakfast. If you if you decide to leave anything, just saying. Well, we're going to make sure we leave you guys some food for sure. <laughs> good deal. Tell me what's, what's going on. What do you got cooking out there? So we got some of, some of Johnsonville's products out here. Um, on 6th Street, we are on 6th and Niches. We're serving up the Johnsonville original broth and then our grillers. So what our grillers is, it's a brand new product really to Johnsonville. A lot of people don't really know what it is. It is a pork patty, so essentially it's a pork hamburger. Okay. So it's the flavor is built in. So what we have is the bacon cheddar flavor. So it requires no seasoning, literally from the freezer to the grill in about 30 minutes, it's done. Highly recommend you guys try it. Come on out, they're only $3. And like I say, the proceeds go to charity. Okay, got it. So the, for those of uh, for those out there like me who may not have access to a grill, can you cheat and do it on in a pan on on the on the stove a absolutely obviously we're always <laughs> going to encourage you guys to grill but but there's ways around it so what we have for you guys today is a little bit of a recipe it is grilling season you guys have a much longer grilling season in Austin than we do oh yeah in year Wisconsin. round pretty much yeah backyard parties happen all the time yeah, you you guys are very very spoiled so we brought you guys what's called the brat hot tub so it works in a, in a crock pot where uh -huh. it also works um, on your grill in an aluminum foil pan so basically the first ingredient is every man's favorite beverage there so grab your favorite beer all right you're just going to pour a little bit of beer in there. And you've already got, is this water that's nope, in there? No, it's beer. Beer's already in there. Oh, okay. Yep. Got it. That's a... So, so the okay. best thing about the Brat Hot Tub is people are grilling. It's an all-day event. Mm -hmm. um, so instead of just grilling up some brats and then kind of letting them sit out all day, this is a great way to keep them flavorful, fresh, and delicious all day long. So if they're on the grill, you want to go ahead and put your grill low and slow. So just on the low, put your aluminum foil pan in there, put your beer in there. You want to throw about a stick of butter in there. Mm -hmm. You're actually going to go ahead and you're going to dice up some onions. Uh -huh. So you're going to throw the onions in there, keep it flavorful. Shut your grill all day long. It's going to be fresh. But like you said, also it works in a crock pot. Yeah, this is my home. my kind of thing with a you know condo. I do a lot of crock potting, making meals for the entire week. <laughs> well, there you go. So the, the, again, they're going to keep on fresh all all day long, and it also works with our grillers too. Mm -hmm. So don't be afraid to uh, try your favorite brat in there. Try your favorite griller to uh, just to keep it you know flavorful all day long. Perfect. What do you have out there for folks to experience at the Pecan Street Festival today? What can they get a taste of? So you get to see the world's largest grill. The Big Taste Grill itself is 53,000 pounds, 65 feet long. The lid alone weighs about 6,000 pounds. Mm -hmm. So obviously, and your normal person just can't lift that lid, we got some nice air pressure to help us lift that yeah. lid on up. When, it's, when the lid is lifted, it's about 20 feet tall. So out there, we do have an observation deck. So you guys come on by. You can walk up an observation deck. You can see us grilling up there. And up top, we have four different grills. Our four different grills are four feet by two feet, mm -hmm. which gives us about 32 square feet of grilling space. We can put about 750 brats up there. And like you said, grilling up about 2,500 in an hour. Wow, that is crazy. Was it pretty busy out there yesterday? The weather was beautiful. This was actually our busiest event to date. So uh, we are partnering with the American Cancer Society. Mm -hmm. So the proceeds are going to go to them. Uh, you guys will see them out there on the grill. They're in our serving trailer. So they're keeping all the proceeds. They're doing most of the work. Uh, you know, I'm kind of just in the behind the scenes, making sure everything's running smooth. Um, but it's all for a great cause, guys. It was an amazing festival, much larger than what I thought. It, I don't think I ever saw the end of it. Any which way I walked down yeah. 6th Street, any direction, there was always stuff going on. Yeah, grilling for a great cause out there. And, you know, guys aren't the only ones that like brats. For Mother's Day, get your mom out there. I, I, absolutely. So it is Mother's Day. Mm -hmm. I encourage you guys to... Uh, to come on out, grill up some brats, put them on the brat hot tub all day. They're going to stay nice and, and delicious and fresh all day long. We have so many different flavors of grillers and brats that uh, you can find something for everybody. Yeah, that way uh, dad's out there, guys. You don't have to worry about the cooking. You, you. Absolutely. Bring her, bring her on over. If, if tell you what, if it's if you happy some other day, come find me. I'll make sure we give you guys a special experience. We'll give you guys a tour of the grill and uh, maybe a little discount for you yeah. guys. Yeah. Oh, you can't beat that. You heard it right here um, from his mouth. Thank you so much for uh, coming in. Looking forward to maybe snacking on uh, on some of these things a little bit later.